Hello everyone and welcome to our weekly how-to video. My name is Lori McNorton, Floral Design Coordinator for Florist Review and Super Floral. And today I want to share with you a quick and simple technique using some aspidistra leaves, some paint, and making a really cool treatment. Um, it's going to be a collar for our hand-tied bouquet. So let's get started. First of all, like I said, um, I'm going to use aspidistra leaves. Now, I did go ahead and paint these so we won't fumigate in here. But um, so just took the aspidistra leaves, took the um, color tool spray paint, and tipped the leaves. Didn't I don't want to do the whole leaf. I just want the very tip of them. So I have several of those done ahead of time. Now the fun little treatment is we're going to make the tips and use pins and make this a cool little collar. So each leaf, I'll show you how simple this is. I've got my corsage pins here. I'm just going to fold this under. Then I'm going to take my corsage pins straight in, out. There we go. A little sewing technique here. In. And that's going to be my neat little treatment. So let's do a couple more here. Now you can use any color. I wanted something bright and colorful so it's going to show up on the camera. And I've got these beautiful orange and yellow lilies. So I thought the hot pink. Actually, it's called raspberry, but I thought that would be a really pretty contrast. And there we have it. How simple is that? Like I said, you can use any colors. You can use metallics. And that's like this leaf is split, but when we get this done, you won't even be able to tell that. So it's an easy way to use some of the foliages that you might not think are usable. All right, so I have several of those made. Put those over there, get those ready. I'm going to make a little hand tied here with these beautiful lilies. And I decided to use a couple different colors. These are Sun Valley lilies. They're gorgeous. And I'm just going to take a few time together. I think for my vase, that'll be plenty. So like I said, I'm just holding them here in the center point. Then I'm going to take my leaves. I just make a collar. off Sean then I'm not so so high there we go oops let's remove this that definitely is a contrast against that orange and the yellow also have some lily grass I thought about some mini green hydrangeas, but I don't think I need it. I think this is really going to be enough. So this is a very simple bouquet, but with a really cool treatment. And you could use any flowers with this treatment for the aspidistras. Give it some movement here. Okay, then let me cut some of these off. Take me some covered wire here. Just 
Go around a couple times. Tie that off. That is pretty cool if I say so myself. <laughs> All right, then I have just a simple vase, which I carried through with the green. This is lots of color here. Recut all my stems. Voila, there we have it. And then I'm gonna... Sometimes I think this in my head and we're not really sure how it's gonna turn out. <laughs> but I think this is pretty cool. It's very colorful. How simple would that be to you do? There you have it. Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you next week. Have a great day. Thank you.